guys welcome back to Drew tutorial and if you're new special welcome to you and in this video I'm going to show you how to block any application or programs on your Windows 11 PC using your Windows firewall so you want to stick around and follow my instruction step by step so that you can be able to block any application you want so let's take microsoft edge as an example right now what i'm going to do i'm going to open up the edge application and i'm going to show you that it's actually working i can go to google i can go to youtube or whatever i want you will see that it is currently working right so if i go to youtube and i type in drew tutorial you can see it's working i can find my channel and youtube hey guys welcome and youtube is working fine so here you have it Edge is working fine. So we will use this as an example in this tutorial to show you that it's it. we are able to block it. So in order to block this application, guys, you want to go to your control panel. So click the Windows key on your keyboard and type in control. You want to go to control panel. And from here, you want to find the Windows Defender firewall. So you want to click on that. Now from here, you want to click on advanced settings on the left side. And here it will open up the Windows Defender firewall with advanced security. Now, once you have this open, you want to create an inbound rule and an outbound rule. So we will go ahead and create an inbound rule first, and then we'll create the outbound rule. So click on inbound rule. Then you want to click on new rule on the right hand side. You can see it. So click on that. Now you want to ensure that you have the option that says program. Then you want to go ahead and click next. Now here it's asking you to select the part of the, the program. You can click on browse and you can find that application that you want to, let's say block, or it's very easy. I will show you another way how to easily find this. So you want to go ahead and click the Windows key on your keyboard, as I mentioned, type in Edge, and you'll find Microsoft Edge. You can do this for whichever program you want, right click, and then click on open file location. This is open on my next screen. Now from here, you want to go ahead and find the edge again. So now from here, you want to scroll down and as you can see, it finds the Microsoft Edge. So what you want to do, right click again on this application here. You want to go ahead and click on open file location again. And this will take you into where the application final part is. Now you want to ensure that you go to this exact path to where you'll find the, the exe file. So whichever application you have, you want to do that for that path. So let me go back and show you. So let's say if I wanted to do it for Google Chrome, I'll right click on that and I'll go to open file location and it will take me to the chrome.exe. So that's how you can do it. Let me go back and let's continue with edge. So right click on the edge click on open file location and here is the exe file now from here you want to right click and you want to click on copy path now once you do this this will copy the exact path of that application now you want to go back to the inbound rule click there and Control v to paste the path now if you look closely you can see that it actually adds open quotation and a close quotation you want to remove both of these so remove those quotations at each at each side the start and the finish i would suggest that you copy it because you will need it for the outbound rule now go ahead and click on next now from here you want to choose block the connection then click on next you want to leave all three domain private and public checked click on next and here you want to give it a name so we can call this edge for example block something like that right and then click on finish and now the inbound rule is now created. So let's click on the outbound rule and click on new rule. And let's do the same. So select, leave it on program, click next, enter the path, then click on next, leave it and block the connection, click next, leave all three selected, click next, and click edge, for example, and type block, right? Or blocks, whatever you want. You can name it whatever you want. Then click on finish. Now, as you can see, I've created both rules, right? So all I will do now is just go ahead and show you that the edge is blocked. So if I go ahead and try to open up edge, now you will see it is trying to load. And let's give it a moment and you will see that it actually blocks. And there you have it, your internet access 
is blocked and that's how you can easily go ahead and block it so guys if you're looking for a way how to block any application on your windows 11 pc using the windows firewall then this is how you can easily go ahead block any application using the windows defender firewall i really hope you found value here within this video guys and if you do don't forget to give this video a like let me know in the comments below and hit that subscribe button thank you guys for watching and see you next time